Hey folks, welcome to InTheMoneyStocks.com's live trading action video. My name is Gareth Soloway, Chief Market Strategist here. Today's date is Tuesday, April 12th. 2016. Take a look at the SPY right now. This is the intraday chart. I want to focus in on what's happened today, so let's zoom in a little bit. This is today's action, and again, each candle is 10 minutes long. So the markets today opened flat to positive. You got a small move up, and then we started to retrace back down, and we actually broke yesterday's low pivot. Now, this level at 204, here's the 204 level right here on the SPY, has been the unbelievably biggest level I have seen in months, if not broaching or breaching on a year-long period. I mean, it has been amazing how this level 204 has held. Now, it was so interesting because we got below the 204 level on an intraday basis, and we tagged this upsloping trend line. I want to show you where this comes from. Very important you see these trend lines. All right, so what you can see here is, I have to go back a little ways here, but if you take the pivot low on the 10th of March, right there, and you extend it out, okay, it connects right through this low, and right through the low of today. Unbelievable how charts on trend lines on charts work. I mean, just absolutely astounding. Anyways, point is this. Just as it looked like the market was going to break down, and we were borderline, folks. I tell you this. I stress it to you because <clears throat> this market has this ability to kind of reverse itself at major levels. And just as we were about to break down, we got major news out that it was just a rumor, in fact, but it was still that Saudi Arabia and Russia might be near a deal to curb production of oil. And what does oil do? It rips higher, rips higher, and the markets just start to rip higher as well. And we saw this short squeeze start once we got up here, short squeeze all the way up to this little pivot high. And that's kind of where we're sitting right now. You have this downsloping trend line, which is resistance as well. But absolutely epic, folks. And I can't stress this enough. And for those of you that don't trade, you may not understand it quite as well. But think about this. The markets have been on the verge of a major breakdown below the 204 level many, many times. And I'm talking 10 times in the last seven trading days, maybe eight trading days now. So we keep hammering on this 204 level. And there's something mysterious that brings us back up, all right? Yesterday, we basically closed on top of that level. Um, if you go back, and this was yesterday right here, the day before that, we pierced the level and then bounced back up. And speak of the devil, look at the market just breaking up right here, folks. Looks like, looks like it's going to be a target here, but I guess my overall point is that this is an amazing market, how just as the market continues to hammer on this major level of 204, right here and again let me zoom out and show you how many times we've been on this line i mean look at this and we're talking about a daily close that's what you need but you can see how you were hammering on the upside right here right and then you pulled back and you finally broke out so i could actually extend this line really even all the way over here but you were hammering 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 you broke through then you came down on it came down here again again pierced it but by the end of the day and let me zoom in on that look at how it recovered right here to close above it then we came down again and again, and then today we pierced, and again, the magical news, the magical rumor spit forth, and this market recovered. So really epic price action here. Now, what are we going to see here? Because look at this trend line. Look at this, folks. From this high to this high to this high, there's a chance that we could break out here. And actually, if you break out, you know where you're going to go? Right here, gap fill. So I actually think this is going to happen now. Based on the reversal today... Um, I think this market eventually, if not today, then tomorrow probably breaks forward and gets up to this gap fill, which will be the next major resistance at 206.40. So again, target for me, 206.40. And at that point, I think you start to see some selling pressure coming in the market. Okay, so we'll keep an eye on that and see how it all plays out. But really amazing price action right now, folks. And again, I will talk to you soon. Come join us at InTheMoneyStocks.com.